to the Odom Police Department where we are going to be doing a records request. Uh, if you've been watching my videos from the start, I, I one of my first videos that I posted was of a sergeant here in Odom that um, charged at my charged at me and uh, screamed, hollered, complained that I was violating people's rights, violating her rights, and that I needed to get a job, <laughs> of all things. But um, I, I haven't had an opportunity to uh, obtain her um, body cam from that incident. Um, once again, it, it was it was a traffic stop. I got out. I was recording it. I told her nothing, said nothing to her, screamed at her, nothing like that. She approached me. She didn't like what I was doing. She gave me a mouthful. So, with that being said, I am actually going to walk over to the Odom Police Department right now and do a open records request for... Uh, now, one of the things about my records request is... I've actually requested the information already via email and was denied saying that uh, the paperwork that I had was not completely filled out, which is uh, BS because the information they were requesting is uh, name, address, city, telephone. Well, I don't need to give that information. I, My understanding is... I can stay anonymous with getting my records. So we're going to go in there. We're going to try to obtain the records again and uh, see what they say. Let's go. should point out one this police uh, department's office sits right on a highway so apologize for all of the um, noise from the roadway two it is a new police department new they pretty created this um
Hi. Hello. Um, I'm the one that sent the uh, email about the record open records request, okay. and then it got denied. Okay. That didn't sound good. Um, but um, but yeah, I, I was told over the phone that I, it was it was denied because it wasn't filled out properly. Right, right. Um, they sent me another email. Then I, did you get my email that I had sent you? Um, um, they said that it was uh, not complete. I don't know correct. if you can. Yeah, I think I think that's what it was. It said it wasn't complete. Right. Uh, and then over the phone, I think we had discussed that um, uh, it, it needed to be signed. It needed to be. Yeah, well, well, the thing is, it's an open records request uh, under uh, Texas code, Texas uh, Texas government code uh, 524. I, I don't have to provide my information it, it, to get obtain the information. So it, it, with the information I put on there, I could put a fake name for all, all for everybody, and it would. It wouldn't matter. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just going off of what our legal department told us. And is your like, legal department here? Is no. there a way I could talk to them? Right now, no. Yes. It's our own city attorney, you know, and all that. But yeah, that's who we have to submit all our documents for open records for something big like that. That's what I was asking if you were involved in it. Because if you were involved in it, you know, it's totally up to the person you know, to get their own records. But that's kind of why it's it's a public records yeah. request. You know, the, these are, you I know, know, these are records. Just a little bit. It changes a little bit. And that's what they had told me to inform you as far as that. So, yeah, I don't know. Did you want to fill it out? Well, I I, I got the original that I sent you, okay. which that I had scanned. Okay. But like I said, I mean, as far as, like, one of the things you had mentioned over the phone was that, you know, you had mentioned that the signature was not complete. Right. And that's what I was asking. If you were involved in it, because if you were involved in it, you know, it's totally up to the person, you know, to get their own records. But that's kind of why it's it's a public records request. You know, these are records. But like I said, I mean, as far as, like, one of the things you had mentioned over the phone was that the signature wasn't, wasn't, right. a, a, it's not your signature. It's not my signature, but how would you know my, what my signature is? That's that, right? The ACC but, is authority check. But I can sign it however I want to, though, right? He wants all this filled out. That's why he's saying it's not complete until it's filled out correctly. Okay, so if okay. I put if I put here, uh, you know, John Doe, address such and such, such but you see what I'm I saying? I can't tell you because I wouldn't know. Okay. But you can try it. I mean, I, that's all I can really do. Is there a way that I can get the information so I can talk to them? Whose information? Wh whoever, whoever's denying me the request. Um, I'm not too sure. Do you have a phone number? And I can. I can give you my phone number. That's not an issue. Okay. You know, the the, the thing is, I'm not. I, I don't have to give you my information. I don't have to put my information on here. Is what I'm getting at. Okay. So just like if I'm not doing anything illegal and if somebody asks for my ID, I don't have to legally give it to them. Okay. So that, that's, that's where I'm going with it. I don't have to legally give like my, my information right, right. if I'm not doing any, I mean, if what I'm asking for, I think is very simple. But, I, and this has nothing to do with you. I understand you have bosses and you're just doing yeah, your job. Just doing you're just doing your job and, and I get that part, but that's why I'm asking, Can is there, who do I talk to? I can, okay. if you want to put your name on it, I can tell me you have questions. I mean, I can try to do that and see, you know, what their response is. I mean, I could try that at least for you and see. You see, I don't know if they're an automated phone call. See, I don't know. I don't know anything as far as legal, how they deal with something like that. Okay. Um, as far as giving my, my phone number, this is the original. Could you have another sheet of paper that you I can... Want another one? Yeah. Okay. Let me go with your notes. Same one. Mm, well, maybe you got a sticky note. I'll put my I'll put my phone number down so that way, whoever can request uh, or whoever is denying the request, they can call me. Okay. If if, if that's allowed. Um, I mean, I don't. Because I know he's gonna want it all on there. Can you just fill it out again, and or if you want to give me the original, this one. I'll give you the original. Yeah, and then.
no, I mean, I'm, like I said, I mean, uh, with this, I should be able to stay anonymous with, okay. with, no, uh, with an open records request. Okay, then. I mean, I can... if they come back, then, you know, like I said, I'm just, I'm trying to get to whoever is denying the request. If they're denying the request, then, but, I mean, that's who I need to talk to as far okay. as like. Because if not, then my next step is go to the Attorney General okay. of Texas and then go through them, okay. which is going to make it a bigger mess than what yeah. it needs to be. Okay, then. I mean, I can try again. I'll submit it again for you, and I'll see what you what okay. tell me. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Tell me what you guys think um, in the comment section. You know, am I wrong? Am I not able to get the records that I'm requesting by trying to stay anonymous? Do I have to give my information? Uh, that's kind of where I'm at right now. This is uh, this is attempt number two in getting my open records request taken care of. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end this video. Authority check out.